welcome back to the channel today i wanted to do a short setup video of how i'm going to use my passport traveler's notebook for 2023 basically just the same as i used it this year which is a wallet and everyday carry or edc but just a little tweak on my inserts and it's been chunky i have been using it all year and this is how it looks like for 2022 setup. I have my vaccination card. Uh, this cloth is from the B size and rarities, and it mainly has my cards, my monthlies for 2022, very colorful and full of stickers. And also, my main wallet setup is in this cloth uh, zipper wallet, and it's been actually very dirty and and crumpled as well so this is mainly what i wanted to replace for 2023 this holds my cash on hand and some coins as well and then this um plastic zipper has my other cards which are mostly for rewards and i also store some ephemeras i acquire and these are my stash for 2023 which i will be setting up in this passport leather and let me just remove everything in here and dust it off a bit as well i actually don't use any leather care product for my tns because they are pretty new and this one is actually just a year old so i like it as it is for now but maybe in the future i'll try some leather care products i will also replace this connecting band from the back as you can see it's been also very dirty but that's because this uh blue tn i noticed the color it transfers a lot so that's why it's it's black already <laughs> let's start with this leather zipper which i got yesterday as a pre-order uh this is actually my second leather zipper already i also got the regular size before because i was initially planning to use the regular tn as a wallet setup and an everyday carry but it's just too big and i feel so awkward bringing that whole notebook and a wallet at the cashier so i just decided to get the passport size and just continue using the same setup for 2023 so this is the leather and it's in a beautiful brown color and it's very thin actually it's just like a cardboard paper in leather if that makes sense and it has three pockets uh the one is the zipper and then it has two pockets on the other side here's a quick comparison between the leather and the cloth zipper and as you can see i feel like the leather is even thinner than the cloth one so that's really good but when it comes to the zipper as you can see the leather is thicker than the uh, cloth one so that's the difference between the two but I still prefer the leather one because the cloth actually gets really dirty over time. So it, it's just good for a year. But the leather, I hope it will last longer. So I'll place this first in here and I'll have the zipper on my left side. And then my monthly insert will be here. I will also include a grid insert which I haven't set up yet but I'm planning to use this as my adulting insert I'll call it because it will hold my monthly budget, bills tracking, and anything related to finance so I haven't set it up but I'm planning to do so before the year ends. I will set it aside first and put it on a separate band. This is the folder insert and the zipper plastic insert. This one is not new, I think, but I haven't used it very much this year. So I'll just reuse it for next year. So I will put the leather first and then the plastic zipper 
and then my monthly insert and i'll just go ahead and slip them in as one in one of the connecting bands in here so there's that one whole thing and then the grid insert will be on a separate band just in case i need to remove it and write something on it i will be easily able to do so and then this plastic folder i will try to insert it in here um on the kind of like a bookmark of the travel Nurse notebook and i'll just slip it in the middle so that's the whole setup and this doesn't have the contents yet the money and all the cards but this is how thick already it is so let's try to add a rubber band at the back so i'm choosing between these three colors but i think i'll just go with the brown one so that it matches the leather insert and this is actually not original from the traveler's company i just like it because of the hardware part like it ties up the ends of this band so that i don't have to tie it up myself and it looks neat this way because there will be no loose threads at the end so let's try to put the cash and cards in here i'll put the bills here on the zipper and i'm thinking if i could also put the coins but i think this will not be a good idea because it will somehow leave a mark on the leather so i'll just remove that for now and then i'll put my cards in this plastic zipper I'll ju i just covered them with some sticky notes so the most used cards which are the debit and the credit card will be here in front and then at the back i'll put i think one id which will be accessible if i need one the rest of the cards which are mostly reward cards in other ids will be still on the plastic zipper so because i don't use them very much and not every day so i'll just put them in one pocket in here and the other important cards which are another debit cards will be also in this leather insert and also the vaccination cards will be at the back in here and then this plastic insert will now hold my ephemeris which i will be using for future journaling session and i think that's it for my whole setup this notebook and wallet setup is practically my whole life plus my phone i can literally bring it anywhere i even bring this couple of times during hiking this year and it also serves as my passport holder when I traveled abroad for the first time this year. So yeah, it has been well traveled and very functional from big to tiny moments like groceries and errands. Really happy with this setup and I am looking forward to have more adventures with this this coming year. And I hope I could also take more photos of this outside. Thank you so much for watching. If you also have a traveler's notebook wallet setup, let me know in the comment section. Bye!